Dr. Mel, you seem uh, like in some of the better moods I've ever seen on a fight week. I feel like you're really, really enjoying it. You're here at home. It's like you said, you've thought about it since a kid. When you think back on, on those memories, how young were you when you really were like, man, like I want to be the best of the best. Like I, I, was, be like, I was fighting. I was in, in Mexico or in Brownsville, close to the valley, chilling with uh, Emmanuel Augusto, watching Floyd, watching Floyd Mayweather fight Marquez and thinking about being an undisputed champion and thinking about being able to get that time where I could be my name and my face on the banner. Like those are the moments that like a lot of fighters probably sometimes won't even ever get. So it's bigger than just being a, a, a undisputed champion. It's about just getting that opportunity to be the main guy. What, what about a, a Terrence Crawford if he ever was willing to go to 54? You think that's a good fight? Yeah, we can make some money. Yeah. I, I believe Danny Garcia also is uh, looking at 154. That's a lot of guys. Why they don't fight each other? Leave me the hell alone. Let them fight each other. Well, they but, want the champ. You know that. <laughs> right? Right? Of course. <laughs> they got to work their way up to the champ. Like, go come prove. I can't see you until you prove it.